Decision making is a skill, a very important skill of life. And other skills that we all know are learning tennis, playing tennis, cooking, writing, things like that. They're crucial. And how did we learn them? Typically, we had some lessons. Second, we practiced a lot the components of what you need to do the skill. There are many components in all of those, and we practice each separately, then we put them together, and then we can do things well. But how did most of us learn decision making? The truth is, we didn't. We picked it up from habit from when we were very young, and we have some good habits and some bad habits in each of our decision making. We never focused on what are the components. Those are crucial to learn them separately. The components of decision making are what is the decision you really want to address. It should start with the word decide to and then whatever it is. Then you want to understand why are you spending your time on this. That's to identify the values and state them as objectives of what you hope to achieve. You can't make a good decision without knowing what you want to achieve. Then you're in position to create much better alternatives than you may be thought of without those objectives being explicit. And then finally, you want to appraise how good each of the alternatives are in terms of the set of objectives and try to choose the best and certainly eliminate the poor ones. It's worthwhile to get some of that practice and to know the basic concepts that you need that practice on.